Alright, so I know some of you guys want to keep up to date with the status of Cartoon Network and if they're going to be changing from Teen Titans Go Network to actually Cartoon Network. So basically, I'm making this video to show you guys the schedule for the past week and I'll be analyzing it, going over what works and what doesn't work. So here we are, this is the schedule for last week. You can see it's not as much yellow as before. There isn't much Teen Titans Go as compared to the previous months. I think the best thing about this schedule is that there's variety. Like, even though those shows here aren't that good there's still variety there's different things showing and this is where Cartoon Network schedule takes a turn for the better because it used to be Teen Titans Go Network and there was nothing else showing Teen Titans Go was literally taking over and it's really stupid for one cartoon to take over because you need to have variety with other cartoons and that's what Cartoon Network did this week you can see Tom and Jerry you can see Open Season Ben 10 Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs now I'm not saying these things are good as I said before but it's variety it's a step in the right direction one very significant thing I should point out is that Steven Universe reruns are back airing on Cartoon Network. Now this hasn't been really shown for a while because Steven Universe wasn't really relevant, there wasn't really any new episodes, but now that there are actually new episodes coming up, Cartoon Network decided to air a bunch of reruns of Steven Universe episodes. And this actually gives me hope for the series, so maybe it won't be cancelled. Maybe they actually want to see Steven Universe do well, who knows. We should celebrate our progress. We should celebrate your progress. You've grown a lot this year. He certainly has. Yeah. But anyway, let's talk about these movies that you see on the schedule. So open season, open season two, open season three. I, I really don't even, like, why was there two sequels to this movie? The fact that they're showing these movies is good because it's like a break in the day. You see all these cartoons that we already know, and then you get a movie. And let me point out, on Friday, April 28th, we got Scooby-Doo the WWE Mystery. Can we help you kids out? John Cena! <laughs> I gotta give credit to the guys over at Cartoon Network for putting this there. Scooby-Doo meets John Cena is literally the best thing I've seen, and the fact that they air it on Cartoon Network, I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty amazing. But anyway, look on the weekend, there's a lot of Teen Titans Go, but again, you have Steven Universe reruns, you have Gumball episodes, and overall, this schedule just has a lot of variety. I feel like if Cartoon Network keeps doing this sort of thing, then they might see an increase in ratings for other shows, because when you have variety like this, you're actually giving the other shows a chance, and more people will probably be interested in them. And when you have these movies in the middle of the day, like Spy Kids 3D Game Over, who wouldn't want to see Spy Kids again? That was the best movie ever that had amazing effects. So basically, Spy Kids and the Scooby-Doo WWE Mystery, these are two masterpieces of movies, and I'm glad Cartoon Network decided to air them. But it's just showing that they're actually trying to improve, and it's not just all Teen Titans Go Network. I hope they keep doing this variety. I think they will. But yeah, once new shows come out on Cartoon Network, I feel like they'll do more variety with those shows because I really don't want to see Ben 10 or Cloudy with a chance of meatballs but again I can just watch anything I want online I don't even have to watch Cartoon Network on the TV we're riding on the internet cyberspace set free hello virtual reality interactive appetite searching for a website a window to the world got to get online take a spin now you're in with the techno set you're going surfing on the internet so yeah, Cartoon Network schedule is definitely doing better, at least this past week was good. Hopefully the upcoming weeks will have as much variety as this because we need new shows, we need to see all this different stuff, and even if they're not good shows, it's still variety, it's something to look forward to. Anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Be sure to give a thumbs up and comment below to let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.